My name is Daniel Muhia. I'm the co-founder of Green Server Agri Solutions. Green Server Agri Solutions is a Kenyan company that is focused on delivering innovative and sustainable solutions to the small and medium entrepreneurial farmers in Kenya. We work with like-minded partners such as Akista in delivering these solutions from world over as well as locally. So uh, today, the 20th of September 2019, we've organized an activity uh, in demonstrating a barsha water-powered pump in Sagana, Kirinyaga County, and this is how it has been. My name is Florian. Uh, I'm the Sales and Operations Officer at Akista uh, from the Netherlands. So Akista themselves, they were founded in 2012, so uh, uh, seven years ago now, by a Nepalese, a Dutch, and a German guy. So it started out as an international uh, startup already. They take, came together in their master studies. They met them. They met each other through their studies, and they were like, "Okay, so what can we do to uh, create impact in this world?" And they came up with this. Uh, they they came across this concept of the spiral pump. This is called the Basha pump. So, the pump is capable of lifting water up to a vertical head of up to 20 meters. On a horizontal surface, it's able to deliver water up to about two kilometers on a horizontal surface. So the pump works on uh, uh, the, the spiral technology. So these are the mouths that uh, will suck in the water. And then the pedals are, are, are just useful to support the pump in, uh, in the rotation of the spiral. And then it continues to build up the pressure until it's able to lift up to 20 meters high. The pump has a capacity to deliver up to 40,000 liters uh, on a day. Normally, whenever you have um, renewable energy pumping water, like a hydro-powered pump, you can harness the pumping from 6 a.m. in the morning until 6 a.m. the following morning. So with, that, with such a technology, it's not possible for you to have the pump and then somebody standing in by every crop, watering, then moving to the next and then to the next because it will be completely tedious. So we normally encourage, encourage the farmers that you will pump in the water to a reservoir which can be 10,000 litre tanks, to, it can be a lined pond, 100,000 litres tank, and then now you can utilise gravity, especially in places where, there is a, where they are slanted. You can now utilise either drip irrigation or you can utilise sprinkler irrigation. As you can see there down, I have started irrigating that, that cabbage is our those, those kumawiki and those spinach. Uh, before there, I have been using it in the in the in the sweet potato vines there. When the, there is there was a lot of volume in the river, the water was coming here in the in the vines. I was using there. For me, I can see that barsha pump. It is very useful and it is help to, uh, to, to farmers. So as a project, what we did is we went to Netherlands. We looked at the technologies in the Netherlands, and then we try to pick the ones we think are relevant uh, to uh, our farmers. And we saw the basha pump, and we think this is a relevant technology that can be applied to smallholder farmers in Kenya. It has been used in uh, Nepal, which has uh, similar situations. It is uh, used in Malawi. So we think also in Kenya it can be uh, applicable. It's not just pumping the water. Once you pump the water, how do you apply it to the crops? And that's why we are also encouraging uh, drip irrigation and, and sprinklers because those are more efficient in, uh, as systems of uh, irrigation. Without water, there is no agriculture. Without agriculture, Kirinyaga will be poor. People who are using water here, it is very, very expensive because they have to use pumps, either diesel-driven or petrol-driven. So if you can have other alternative ways of getting that water from the river, to the farms. I'm sure we cannot finish that water, but we will create wealth in our farms and the excess water flows down to the ocean. Asante Nisana, and we hope this will trickle down to our farmers to create more wealth for Kirinyaga. Asante Nisana. Thank you so much. Asante Sana, Director and account Engineer na Agribusiness Officer for finding your uh, time to come over and uh, grace this particular occasion. We appreciate all those who joined in, in the activity, as well as you, for watching and viewing this video. Uh, if you would like to uh, follow us, you can follow us on uh, Twitter at greensub underscore ag. You can as well follow us on Facebook at Greensub Agri Solutions, as well as LinkedIn on Greensub Agri Solutions. Or you can visit our website on www.greensub.co.ke 
and send us an email on info at greensub.co.ke or you can call us on 0720-404-827 as they appear on your screen. Thank you so much for watching and we look forward to you following us on our social channels. Thank you.